12 minutes after the noon hour, get over to Storm Team 4 meteorologist Brian Niznanski. Well, you got half the equation right, it seems, for the holidays. It is going to get cold, but you got no snow. <laughs> Yeah, cold enough for Santa uh, to be <laughs> trugging around uh, Christmas Eve night. But yeah, we're going to be lacking some snow. Uh, we do have one more chance of accumulating snowfall, and that'll be late Wednesday. So as we take a look here, historically, over the past 25 years, we've had a 40 percent, 40 percent of the time we've had a white Christmas. Now, the forecast this year, I'd put it at about 15 percent. Uh, we have a few snow showers on the way this afternoon. I don't think that'll give us any accumulation. A little better chance for accumulating snow on Wednesday. More on that in just a second. All right, here we go. Let's take a look here uh, across uh, southeastern Wisconsin. Right now we do have uh, some scattered cloud cover, some peaks of sun. In fact, we're seeing more sun than I thought we'd see today, so it feels pretty good. Uh, as we head into the afternoon, though, we're going to start to focus our attention uh, to the northwest. We have uh, some areas of uh, rain showers and snow showers back towards northwest western Wisconsin, the Twin Cities, and this will all be dropping down. And eventually uh, we have our shot of seeing some scattered rain and snow showers. So let's go through future forecast here as we head through the afternoon. There you go. By three o'clock, I do think we start to see some of these rain and snow showers move in. First communities will be like Beaver Dam through Watertown and then eventually across all of southeastern Wisconsin. Still an isolated snow shower to go around, I don't know, seven, eight o'clock. Couple flurries maybe up towards Sheboygan through midnight. And then we're dry uh, waking up Tuesday. Lots of sunshine. Going to be a nice sunny day on Tuesday. Tuesday, a nice warm day too. As we head into Tuesday night and Wednesday morning, we're going to look for the clouds to thicken up once again. And then here comes our rain chances. First rain showers in the morning on Wednesday, and then a harsh cold front passes through and the rain will quickly change the snow. And we could see some minor accumulation with this uh, Wednesday afternoon. Not a big snowstorm, but maybe enough to coat the ground and give us a white Christmas. We need an inch for it officially to be a white Christmas. Uh, as far as the rain showers and snow showers this afternoon, maybe a few hundredths of an inch of snow. Maybe you get a dusting on the grass. All right, here you go. <clears throat> excuse me. The, currently in Mil <clears throat> excuse me. Currently in Milwaukee, 42 degrees. Winds out of the northwest at 17 miles per, per hour. A bit breezy in Waukesha. Look at that. We got a good amount of sunshine still. 36 degrees currently in Waukesha. Weather headlines: afternoon shower, certainly possible. Mild few days ahead. And then the Christmas cold. OK, your forecast for today, mostly cloudy and breezy. A uh, chance of rain and snow showers into the afternoon. High temperature pretty much where we stand at 42. For tonight, mostly cloudy and breezy, a low of 30 degrees. And here is your seven day forecast on Tuesday. Mostly sunny, 42. Rain changes the snow on Wednesday, 45 for the high Wednesday morning. I think we're in the 20s by late afternoon. Christmas Eve, 16 only for the high. Wind chills could be flirting with zero. In fact, I think Thursday night, we could be close to zero actual temperatures. We're going with a low of three in Milwaukee. Christmas Day, partly cloudy, 20 degrees only. Up to 33 the first day of Kwanzaa on Saturday. And a chance of light snow on Sunday with a high temperature of 35 degrees. So for Christmas time, definitely going to feel like winter. Still in question whether we're going to have some snow on the ground, Vince. Yeah.